Hello there, YouTube. It's your boy, the Mad Hatter, a.k.a. Tim. And Madden is here. The real version of it is here this time. Retail version of the game is out. I actually don't have it yet, though. I'm still moving into my apartment for school, so this is some early access gameplay still here. Uh, but I'm picking up the game later today, and I will definitely be playing it a ton before school starts next week where I won't be able to play as much. But let's hop into this game right here. It's a really, really good game. Comes down to the wire. My opponent is a beast. Uh, as you can see right here, running the FL screen, uh, he's the Patriots, I'm the Ravens, if you couldn't tell by now. So, this was the first time I used the Ravens on this game. They were my favorite team from last year, and they're still pretty beastly. Um, the fact that it's so hard to stop the run in this game makes teams with good defenses that much better. And the Ravens have nice defense. They have, they have a nice... Uh, linebacking core nice d-line so it makes stopping the run a lot easier and then their offense you know it's gotten a lot faster over the past couple years they got tory smith uh jacoby jones ray rice bernard pierce uh i mean tyrod taylor if you want a fast quarterback as i take off with joe flacco right here but no the ravens are a nice team i like using them and uh yeah they're just they're fun to use so right here i get down into the red zone after i held him to a field goal on his drive and he's playing a lot of fag D, but for some reason not having a QB spy out there. So I'm able to just take off with my quarterback pretty easily. Right here, I, I want to go for it on fourth and three because I don't want to take a field goal. I feel like they're pointless, um, especially because he got a field goal, so it'd just be 3-3. Three, three. I'd rather take my chances and go up 7-3, and uh, that's exactly what I ended up doing right there on the drag route to, J to Jacoby Jones. So we're up 7-3 right now, and now we're paying him back right here. A little little fag D on him. So <laughs> right here, he throws it deep to, deep to Gronk. I'm lucky he didn't have a faster receiver right there. Otherwise, that probably would have been a touchdown. But oh well, I uh, get the lay the boomstick on him right there. Don't get a fumble or anything, and he ends up picking the first, picking up the first down on third down. So I'm having a lot of trouble getting off the field on third down, and luckily he went for a field goal on his fourth down earlier because otherwise I don't think I would have gotten him off the field. So I'm pretty, I'm feeling pretty fortunate to be up seven to three at this point, right before halftime. This first half feels like it went so fast, it was ridiculous. So I get him to another fourth down right here. He ends up kicking another field goal. So I feel really good about my defense in this first half right here. I hold him to only six points, and I have a chance to go up fourteen to six and get the ball at halftime. So I could take a really commanding lead right here, and let's hope I do that. But I kind of forget what happens actually. So. Right here, I am. I have a third down, and I try to lead pass up, but he didn't lead pass it very well right there. Dumbass Joe Flacco shouldn't be paid that much. But I end up getting it on the next down, fourth down, and get out of bounds. So that was a clutch play right there. I got two timeouts left, so we got a score here. I go right back to the drag route, and I pick up 10 yards, only take five seconds off the clock. So we're going tick, 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 tick. I thought I was going to get a freaking touchdown right here, but he ends up tackling me at the one yard line and I have to take my field goal right there I ran out of time and I had to end up taking a field goal so it's 10 to 6 I wish it could have been 14 6 but oh well I have the lead and the ball so I can't ask for much more than that uh, once again I just want to tell you guys if you're on the fence at all about buying this game if you're watching this video you probably aren't but if anyone watching is debating getting this game don't debate it it's a sweet game and it's definitely a lot of fun and it's worth it in my humble opinion so uh if you guys haven't heard or seen my video earlier today route combo and i put out another ebook just like our carolina one last year it's uh it's got a ton of plays in it all the plays are broken down by video there's seven different formations uh you can audible between like four of them so definitely go ahead and check that out if you guys haven't checked it out our last year's guide got super positive feedback and i think this one is even better this year uh just so you know it is a custom playbook so if you don't want to run a custom playbook or something then i don't suggest buying the guide but you're basically going to have to run a custom if you want to set your audibles this year just with the way the game is uh it's pretty frustrating you can't set your audibles unless you make a custom playbook so i think most people online are going to use customs so that's why Route Combo and I decided to do a not a team specific one. So you see right here, getting back to the gameplay, he's just playing ultra fag D in the red zone. It's working though. And I, I got to get into the end zone here. I don't want to take another field goal. It would have just been too frustrating. So right there, he misses his user luckily. And I'm able to get in the end zone, take a 10 point lead with like four and a half minutes left. So we're feeling good. I mean, 
he's not going to score two times in the last four minutes considering he's only scored 14 points the entire game. There's just no way. So um, I just got to lock up on defense right here. And that is not working out that well because he's dotting me. And then when I think he's going to pass and dot, he runs. That's a run dot right there. But, <laughs> man, it's just so frustrating when I can't get off the field on third and fourth down. I feel like I should stop him. And then he picks up a lucky third or fourth down. And, ah, oh, it's just backbreaking. But right here, I get a first down, so now I can just run the clock out. And, uh, oh, no, I cannot believe Joe Flacco underthrew that freaking route. I had Ray Rice wide open for a touchdown, but he underthrew it. It's BS, but that's what happens, I guess, with Joe Flacco, even though he won the Super Bowl last year. Still underrated. Um, so now he has the ball. I, I make one mistake this whole game. Get, get a turnover, and now he has the chance to win the game. So that is not what I wanted to do. But luckily, right here, I get him to a fourth down. He tries to draw me off sides. <laughs> like, if that would have worked, I would have been so heated, let me tell you. But he ends up um, just kicking a field goal and tying it up. So now it's overtime. Luckily, I get ball in overtime. So now all I got to do is score, not make a mistake. Almost throw an interception right there. Oh, my God. That would have been bad. But I don't throw a pick. I get sacked, though. It's third and 14. It's not looking too good for me right now. But dot Jacoby Jones let's go get the touchdown over the top it's your boy the Mad Hatter check out the ebook if you haven't already like comment subscribe all that good stuff have a good day guys and enjoy your Madden plan peace